All right, so the cat camel is a nice drill to teach you how to basically move your entire spine from uh, upwards and downwards. We're flexing and extending the lower back, mid back, and actually your cervical spine, which is basically just your neck. So the reason why this one's so important is for one, we often get trapped in certain uh, positions with our spine. So people tend to be extended and they never actually get to a flex position. People actually tend to be out here with their neck and they never actually learn to get here. So this drill is just about getting the spine some movement that it's not usually doing, but it's also really, really important for um, learning how to or ro rotate your hips. And the reason why that's important is because putting your hips in the proper position is huge for posture, but also just proper use of your core muscles during planks and during um, all kinds of different exercises where to get out of this posture when you're extended, which I'm exaggerating, but a lot of people look like this when they do all kinds of exercises, to pull your hips down, feel your abs a little bit more and be in a better posture is actually where you wanna be for a lot of your exercises. And you gotta think about that while you do not just this exercise, but it's practice for doing them and finding the right position in other exercises. The drill itself is pretty simple. However, what I'm gonna show you is a lot of people sit kind of more here, and I'm, again, I'm exaggerating, but then they'll find this middle spot, which is like kind of neutral. We got a little curve here, and we got a little curve up here, and I'm a pretty flat back, so it's you'll probably look a little bit different. But what I, what I see a lot of is I'll tell people to arch their back, and they'll go like this. Then I'll tell people to, to round their back, like to go the other way, and they'll do, they'll do this. And the reason is because they're so used to going into that arch position that the idea of moving their spine, if they're, if they're gonna move their spine or, or, flex, or use some muscles, they're actually like the only way they, they actually conceive like the ability to do that is to actually go to this because they're locked in this position a lot. So it takes some thought to getting all the way around. So for Cat Campbell, what we wanna see is we're going up and then around, up, so this is the spot that most people are more comfortable going up with a head. But what I wanna see here is the chin gets tucked almost like a double chin and you're rounding your back by bringing your belt buckle, your belly button towards your mouth. So right here I'm going. Up. And this is the one that you wanna get better at, the rounded one for most people are gonna to need to practice getting that back rounded. So if it feels a little bit weird, go with it, work on it on a daily basis. It's a great warm up drill for before your workouts. It's a good one to finish off with or a good one to put in as filler in between your strength exercises, anywhere in your strength workout, or just to do at home for some, you know, just some basic mobility on off days.